Hello everyone, Laura here with another recipe for the 33-33-33 vegan challenge where I attempt to make 33 dishes with 33 ingredients for just $33. Please go to my first video to understand what we're doing here. Today will be dish number 18, bean patties on rice with sauce. Here are all the ingredients you will need. Ignore that white bowl on the left there. That was a mistake. And there's a list of all the ingredients as well. And I used a food processor, which does make this a lot easier. You can use a handheld mixer, uh, but I do recommend a food processor. Go ahead and put in the rice. And then add your black beans and add some lentils. And then go ahead and ignore the tomato sauce that you see there and just add the red onions. And then add some sweet potato. Add in the salt and pepper. And your soy sauce. Also in my second batch, I decided to add a clove of chopped garlic, so go ahead and do that too. And then you're going to go ahead and mix that well in a food processor, but not too much. And then you're going to put it into a bowl and set it aside in the refrigerator to chill for about 30 minutes. And just know you'll have a lot left over after this um, dish today. Now for the sauce. So the reason why I said to ignore the tomato sauce in the bean mix is because I made a batch without it and I think it turned out a little thicker and better. So we're gonna just use that tomato sauce in this sauce so we have more of it. And go ahead and add soy sauce and peanut butter in with the tomato sauce and put it into a blender so it gets mixed really, really well. And then heat your oven to 350 degrees and make your bean patties um, any size that you would like and put them in the oven for about 40 minutes, flipping over halfway through. So you really only need two bean patties for this dish. I made four, um, I don't know why, maybe I'll use those in a future dish, I don't know. Go ahead and heat your rice up any way you'd like and put it on a plate and then add your two bean patties on top of the rice and then pour your sauce on top of the bean patties. And you can also add broccoli to this dish because broccoli is on our list and we should have extra. So if you'd like to add some greens to this meal, you can. However, I didn't show that here. And there you go. It turned out pretty good considering I was limited on ingredients. I hope you enjoy. Thank you for joining me again today. Please like and subscribe and bell me so that I know you watched until the end of the video and to let me know you're out there and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye!